computing security is one of the most exciting areas in the broader field of computing. And the reason for that is that it has one characteristic that's different from all the others, and that is that there's an adversarial relationship out there. There are just bad people out there. The kind of folks that are out there that are willing to take your retirement, that they're willing to drain your bank accounts, and as long as they profit, they don't care. And one of the challenges I have with students is, is um, shaking that innocence. Uh, and it's not fun, but they have to understand that this isn't a, a game of Call of Duty where we're going to meet up at the local bar for a drink and high five afterwards. This isn't a game. I had a friend that said he was preparing for this thing called the Collegiate Cyber Defense Competition, CCDC. So that's a big uh, college defense competition where they have industry professionals come in and try to hack your infrastructure and you have to defend it for an entire weekend. And I was like, that sounds awesome. How can I get involved? The students, uh, when they come into the competition, they're given essentially a system of computers and servers and that represent a real world business. They walk into the room and they're given something that they've never seen before and they're told that previous IT team was fired because they did a lousy job and they are the new IT team and their job is to clean everything up and get every, fix everything and have everything up and running. Meanwhile, while these guys are trying to learn about this new system that they've inherited, there is this red team. Uh, they're the ha hackers. They're, they represent the bad guys on the internet. So they're trying to hamper uh, the students' uh, efforts in trying to get their systems up and, and maintain. Who's on, who's logged into vSphere right now? Me. I am. What, are you working on WordPress or messing with Grub? No. No one Matt. else is? Matt. Yeah. I'm, no, Matt. I'm, I'm looking what? at it right now, but I don't see a Grub at all. Okay, we are, we, we've been... Uh, wait, no. Uh, what were you just working on? Were you so on I'm WordPress? Not. No. So I was okay. compromised. The main purpose of this competition is really to produce the next generation of cybersecurity professionals. We are in desperate shortage for them, and this competition's main focus is to create the next generation of cybersecurity professionals who can defend against breaches that we hear about every day. After just nine hours of just constant competition and just bombardment and really stressful and impactful situations. This is where we kind of get to wind down, kind of meet some of the other competitors, so people from other schools, and there's also a bunch of the sponsors and other industry professionals here that could kind of talk us through, offer us job opportunities, and just offer us advice in general. A lot of companies will want to find out where's the best place to pull talent, and so right here, this competition example of, of a situation where you have a lot of problems starting you at the same time, and so a lot of companies will say, oh, where, do we, where, where can we find battle-hardened students? So they come here, and there's a lot of recruiters here. You can talk to all of them. What's your name? I'm Tyler. Nice to Tyler, you. how are you? I'm well, how are you? I'm doing fantastic. What would be your ideal career? Uh, what, are you, what are you looking for? What's going to get you out of bed? And Competitions like NCCDC allow us to build the interests and skills of the workforce that is needed to further protect us against cyber threats and attacks. If anyone ever considered this field or has any interest in this field or if any schools that have never really interested, I would really recommend this competition because even though we do all this and everybody wants to win, it's all about competition, the whole main goal of this is to learn. And you learn a lot.